Well, I dragged home another one. <clears throat> um, this is a 4.8 out of a 04 Chevy 1500. Complete. Got the harness. It's drive by wire. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with that. I'm gonna, all I'm doing to this motor is I'm cleaning it up. I'm going to build a harness for it, and I'm going to show you guys step by step uh, how to build the harness. I'm going to build a very simple uh, standalone harness and setup for this. I have two other harnesses laying around. I got a partial harness. It was with the 6 liter. Um, got a couple ECMs, so uh, I'm going to convert it to drive by cable. It's a very simple setup. I'm going to clean it up. And I'm probably going to toss this turd in the uh, blazer, potentially. Yeah, that's right. I got the engine complete. I picked it up yesterday for a song. It was out of a smashed truck. It only had 120 on it, 120K. She's a little greasy with the round, desirable round coils. Um, 862 heads. She's pretty clean inside. Rockers look nice and clean. There's no sludge buildup at regular oil changes. But I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm going to toss it in my blazer. <clears throat> Just as a good cruiser, daily driver. I'm not going to go hog wild, throw a cam in it, headers, all that fun stuff. Simple stock, fuel injected motors, plenty for a little 4x4. Four four. Um, I got nothing really, uh, nothing else for updates, you know, other than. Obviously, you've seen the guys, uh, I, uh, I showed you guys I had the 6 liter running. I'm just waiting to get the, just waiting to get some uh, money put together and get the uh, Turbo 350 here rebuilt. It doesn't have that many miles on it since it was serviced. I mean, it's a clean, it's a clean transmission. It came out of a 77 Monte Carlo. I want to drop the pan and look inside. Hell, if, 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 it's in, if the insides are clean, I think I'm just going to throw a shift kit in it, throw some new seals in it, and see what happens. I don't know. I procrastinate too much. How much is a bench job for a transmission rebuild? And who knows how long it was sitting. So, it's up in the air. And then, I got my... I got a posi unit. I think it's an Eaton or Auburn, maybe. You guys can chime in and correct me. This one's out of a 93 Camaro. I'm going to throw it in the S10. I was he and hawing, he and hawing rather, about putting a Ford 88 in the S10 or trying to find an 8.5, but the type of driving I do, I drive like a grandma, so there's really no it's not really necessary. So that's going to be my, one of my other projects that's coming up soon. I'm going to show you guys how to install a Posi unit. In the factory seven and five eighths axle, but the big update was basically just picking up this this lump here. Um, I'm not going to do anything with it for a while. I plan on building a garage. So after I do all that stuff, probably later this year, I want to toss it in. But in the meantime, I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to use it for mock-up. I'm going to build the harness for it, and I'm going to show you guys each step of the way on how I do it especially with the engine being here. I can route the wires how I want them, how I, the lengths I want them, and uh, I'm just going to go from there. So I hope everybody had a nice Christmas, and uh, I look forward to providing you guys with some valuable information going into the new year. So stay tuned for updates, and uh, enjoy your weekend.